Hey, hey. Spring of Faith, Simply Tarot. Okay, this is going to be a special message for the sign of Aries. So if you have Aries in your birth chart, this reading could be for you. These readings are timeless. Only take away what resonates with you. Leave the rest behind. If you haven't subscribed, please do so and hit that little bell. That will notify you every time I upload. Um, please do give this reading a thumbs up. That way YouTube sees fit to move it along. And uh, I am doing extendeds now over on Patreon. Uh, not on every reading, but on the ones I feel led to. And if I feel led to, I will say it in the reading. And I will put a link to where it will be. So, I feel like I'm supposed to take one of these first. Angels and Ancestors deck. Beautiful. I love them. Can I have one please? One. One please. Can I have one? There we go. We got two. Okay. Mountains, stand your ground. Mother Earth, feel loved and comforted. Okay. So there's something, there seems to be some mountain you feel like you're having to climb right now. And you're being told to stand your ground where that's concerned. And you need to know that you are loved. And feel comfort. Okay, this has to do with a soul connection. If you don't believe in soulmates, then a very strong connection. We have another, please. We have one more. One more, please. One more. We got too many. I'm gonna take the bottom one because I feel like, well. Okay. Confusion. Okay. So you may be confused or either they're confused and you feel like you're having to climb mountains to, <laughs> yeah, see that's confusion. Okay, somebody's confused about this connection. That's what I'm getting. So Aries, you may feel like you're connected to someone and you can't figure out why. You may not have even met this person, but you feel such a deep connection to them. It's because you've known each other in another lifetime. Oh, they just throwed that one. Okay. Someone wanting to move towards someone, it feels like. Whether that's you or someone wanting to come towards you. Can you tell me more? Can you tell me more, please? More, please. More, please, for Aries. For Aries. More, please. Somebody's watching somebody. It feels like somebody's watching somebody that's balanced and has control of their life. And wanting to go towards that person. Can you tell me more? Someone's got feelings and they don't understand why. Oh my goodness, look. Okay. Okay, you may be wanting to go towards an air sign, it feels like. I'm drawn to that being an air sign, which is Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. But you, there's a feeling, or either they're wanting to come towards you, but there's a feeling with this that, you know, someone... There's a type, there's a feeling of fear that someone will not, um, it's like a, a feeling of not wanting to be rejected. That's what it feels like. Fear of rejection, that's what I'm getting from that. Uh, wanting to go forth and say something, it feels like that you feel this connection so strongly and... Sometimes, you know, some soulmates are not meant to be in our lives, but rather to touch us somehow. 
but um, you know you're wanting to balance this out or either they're wanting to ba balance this out and go towards the other but feeling stuck possibly tied to something negative having to do with money not having enough money wanting a wish and whoever you're wanting to go toward it towards is standing in their truth this is someone that is single I'm feeling whether it's a, a woman or a man and they um, know their worth and their value so that takes me back to this card that may be why there's that feeling of uh, afraid of rejection because this people may be surrounded by other people um, wanting to come together with them wanting happiness this is also about uh, wanting a reunion but this is a soul connection it is so you may have not have met this person in this lifetime and um, yeah being guided is why the Emperor is here I feel like it's being somebody's being guided to go towards someone do we need any more? Can you tell me any more? This is going to go into extended, I can already tell you. Yeah. This is about wanting happy home, happy life, happily ever after. Okay, somebody needs to communicate. Um, it's like they need to communicate with this person. Okay, this person... Um, It feels like this person has abundance around them. The Wheel of Fortune is here. Um, and you know it too. It feels like that for you. If you're the one wanting to go towards someone. That your the Wheel of Fortune is here for you. That things are going to be looking up in your favor. About money. Want, needing to speak to someone. Someone needs to. Um, it's like a message is coming. Either from you. To someone or them to you. Somebody wants to move forward towards someone. They feel like it could be their wish come true. And they're a new beginning. Okay. Romance Angels. And then we will go over into an extended on this. To look a little more deeper. I don't feel like it's going to be a very long extended though. Feels like it will be short can we have one please for Aries please can we have one for Aries for Aries please can we have one for Aries oh my goodness can we have one for Aries for Aries okay yes here we go there you go keep an open mind your soulmate may differ <clears throat> my voice is going out from your usual type and expectations. So this person's different than you. Um, they may seem different. But that's that's a soul connection. You know, it doesn't mean you're, you're automatically going to be the same. Heart to heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. So you need to talk to this person if this is you or if not. They need to talk to you. And look on the bottom. Past life relationship. Yes, you have known each other before. And yes, there is chemistry. There's a strong magnetic tra attraction here. So, it's pretty self-explanatory on them cards right there. They just kind of laid it out for us, didn't they? So, that's what I have. Only take away what resonates. Until next time, bye.